December 5th is the filming date. We'd be doing some prep during the day. Uh, the filming would be uh, in the evening, approximately from about 5 p.m. to 9 p.m., maybe 10 p.m. And uh, I'll have uh, Mr. Cook uh, to give uh, specific details beyond that. That's those, those rough basics of our project. Yeah, we'll, we'll start our evening on North Square, right where uh, Prince Street comes into the square, and the actors will be walking down towards Richmond Street, and we'll um, have Mama Maria's in the background and, and the beautiful square. We will be placing some lights um, along the buildings just to highlight those beautiful buildings on the square, and that will be the first part of our evening. Um, probably take the bulk of it about two or three hours. And then we'd like to finish the evening doing a very short scene uh, on Hanover Street, right by Rich, uh, right by Richmond. Um, if you know where the Citizens right, Bank right, is, okay, not our shoes. On, on that stretch, we picked that stretch because there's not doesn't seem to be a whole lot going on in the evening in the stores. The bank closes at 4 p.m. and so then you're on the street as well. Yeah, for just about five or six houses worth. We'll show the couple walking down the street. And this will be much lower impact. It'll be what we call a steady cam, basically a guy with a camera rig, and he's kind of walking backwards with the actors walking towards him. And you'll see Hanover Street in the background, Vittor Cafe Vittorio, and Mike's Pastry, and all that. And um, it should be a, a very pretty you scene. Have, and have take about an hour. December fifth. December fifth. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> and all the, all of this will take place in the evening, uh, as Jeff said, likely between 5 p.m. and 9 p.m. Five and nine. Yeah. So when you do when you do the when you do the scene on Hanover Street, are you gonna shut the block down? No. It's just no. gonna be kind of things are gonna happen as they happen. Yeah. Just okay. background as it is. Um, cars will be going up and down. Um, we will be doing what we call a wet down, where we basically have a water truck come down the street and put water down. Obviously, if it's cold, we're not gonna do that because we don't want to turn it into an ice rink. But um, it just makes it look really pretty. Young. And you see, if you watch any movie, strangely enough, it always looks like it just rained. That's basically so the street gets prettier as everything okay. blows a bit more. And you've been, you've, you've known five hundred cities. Uh, city yeah, I met, I met with Patty uh, Papa um, earlier this week, and basically her and I came up with this plan. Our major vehicle is going to be out on Blackstone and on Cross, and then um, the stuff that you see in red is basically just for, you know, we're going to load the equipment out of the big 18-wheelers on the back of, you know, pickup trucks, we're called state beds, a little bit bigger. When you say these, are you putting them on trailers? Yeah, yeah. They, like, so they'll use the Cross Street Plaza then, that area? No, the we'll be, there's uh, some two-hour parking out on, on Cross Street. I got you, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, most of it is going to be on Blackstone, um, and I'm going to actually try to put some, um, um, some on some private property there, but most of it will be on Blackstone, the big 18 wheelers, okay. you know, that, you know, the normal trucks you see on a you know, camera uh, uh, film crew. We basically load up the equipment into pickup trucks and then bring them into the north end. That way, we're not bringing the, all the big, you know, the big stuff into, you know, into uh, North Square. And yeah. In fact, Stephen, you mentioned the trailers. All the actors and what we call the base cap will be in Charlestown. So they'll be, they won't be anywhere in New York. Yeah, because we start this day, um, we're filming on Belmont Street in Charlestown um, till sunset. Okay. And so during the day here, you see I have prep here 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. That's just laying the cable in the street, getting getting the, you know everything ready so that when we come, we can put a generator and a light and just plug it in. Um, so it'll be very minimal impact. Traffic will still be able to flow. Pedestrians will still be able to. You're not going to have to like move cars or anything. It's just. <clears throat> we, will, we will have some parking restrictions, basically where you see um, the red lines on uh, North Street, 
um, Garden Street, and then uh, out on Hanover Street. And we will, um, we've been speaking with Lieutenant Mead from the Boston Police Department. We're going to be, we see street closure at the uh, beginning of North Square there. We're going to be closing that down um, just for safety sake. Two, be two vehicles, not foot traffic. Not foot traffic, two vehicles. So we will have to clear some parking on the uh, face of, in front of the Paul Revere House uh, there as well. But you know, we're basically we'll, we'll flyer the whole neighborhood and let everybody know ahead of time. Here's here are the parking restrictions. You know, please be aware of uh, dates and times, and obviously our permits will go up. Did Did Daddy think it was impactful enough to um, like sometimes um, crews come in and they provide like parking vouchers? Yeah, the parcel seven garage um, will have some uh, parking vouchers too, and that was you know her suggestion. Are they going to have it, or are you guys going to be like hanging yeah. around with some vouchers? We're, we're going to have it. We'll, we'll be hanging around. around. And who's going to be? In other words, there'll be. I'll be the Do we have person. a phone number or a yeah, yeah, my my phone number is on that piece of paper, and it'll be on the flyers that we pass yeah. out. You got Tim Gorman? I am. Yeah. That's perfect. Can you are you put that on the flyer? Yes. Oh, yeah. 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 The flyer that we hand out just you know it'll basically give everybody a brief description of who we are, what we're doing, dates and times of parking restrictions, and Tim's phone number. Um, you know, so we're you know we're a 24/7 operation. You got an issue, you can give us a call. You don't have a police detail. We'll have separate. Uh, yeah. Luckily, I think not. So it's a 10 day shoot all in all together. So I, now, if, if we suddenly ran into there's a you know, storm or something, it snows rain feet, or whatever, it snows too feet, yeah. But you will film, if it's snowing, you will film if it's raining. So unless it's a major. Weather, yeah, if there's something maybe we'll be sending notices out and that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The reason we don't want to is it's a 10 day shoot. We're certainly not going to do this on Friday night or Saturday night. That's the so, unless there's some major weather event, uh, we should be. So, so the, the dates, it starts on the 5th, and, and it says the wrap is on the 6th. Yeah, so that we'll come basically we'll come back the next morning because we don't want to work too late into the night. We don't want to keep people up on a Wednesday night. So, you know, we'll leave that night, say around when we're finished, 10 p.m., and come back the next day. You know, streets will be open up, just pull all that cable up. But you just said it's 10 days. So it's not. Oh, 20 no, no, no. Days. no, no, no. Well, it's it's our whole, our, the whole shoot for the pilot oh, okay. is 10 days. We only want to lost some globe for three days. Yeah. So, so this, this 92068 is irrelevant? That, that's a day where some of the cable and some of the that's like we're, we're just picking up right. yeah. Oh, where do you see 926? Uh, right here, that's a typo, sorry about that. Oh. Uh, yeah, 926. Because it looks like you're going to go from... Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, really? It's 10 days? Because yeah. it looks like it's 10 months. That, yeah, yeah. That, that, that would be... Average. No, that's a typo. Okay. Yeah. That would be me at, at 1 o'clock in the morning typing up this map. That, my apologies. No, no, we're just here for one day. So you spoke to Patty, you spoke to Patty. Yes. So, yes. So Patty tomorrow, she'll know. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. And I have a follow up with Patty and the whole film committee on Tuesday again. So if you have any concerns, voice them to me or Patty between now and Tuesday, because Tuesday is when I go in and get the final, you know, final okay. okay. Will this impact the businesses at all that are working right now? We, we're going to make sure that people who are getting, for instance, I'm specific, we're going to make sure that if people know that the businesses are open. We're going to make sure that people, everybody knows who's getting into the businesses that they personally escort people to get in to make sure so no we, we don't get this the 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 only hold up for from a foot traffic standpoint occasionally when we're getting shots we do whatever the frame is we may ask for two minutes of time can you hold while we're doing the take and that's the whole but no, no. which we find more often not people are you know okay with that because they're watching you know films I occasionally get somebody who's you know got some place to be and we do our best to make sure they can get to, to where they're going as quick as possible. This is a TV documentary. TV pilot. TV pilot. So for sure, you know, hopefully it looks good enough that they pick it up and actually. Right, it's for, a, for, for ABC family, so the family oriented shows, you know, geared towards young adults. Um, and the, the idea is that we make this one episode and that they, they like it and come back here next year to do the whole first season and um, bring some more business here. The, the, the city will have a rep there, right? When you're doing a film on, on not. Sometimes Patty's around, sometimes someone from... Well, we know Patty, well, Patty lives right here. She's, she's she going to be around. <laughs> no, because you know what? She's pretty good at when they're towing. She'll run the numbers. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 So you know, yeah. I just suck. It's, it really stinks when you get your car towing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, Trust we, me, we, no. She's good. She has the... Don't she think Patty doesn't have her thumb on all of that. Okay. So, that, that's, yeah. And Lieutenant Mead's there the whole time. Okay. So we run the plates. If they live nearby, we knock on the door. That's the thing. 
And, and my motto is like, again, you have to realize that people live here locally, and you know, these movies go back to California or wherever they're from. We have to come back in your neighborhoods and make another movie. So the less cars we can tell, the less people we have, that's better for us. Okay. Tell a good lieutenant, just said hello, and let you know. Does, um, does anyone have any questions? Okay, we're not going to follow it's just information. Sure. Appreciate it. Appreciate Thank you for helping us. We'll probably be hearing from one of us at least. Some Certainly. Call you for a yeah. Yeah, that's right. Thank you very much. Thank you guys. Good luck. Thank you.